Hey everybody, welcome back. Still sick, but we're gonna end this goddamn war before we die of cancer at 16. Oh god, I hope I live long. But cancer's negative three health, that's pretty steep. Alright, go win that fight. We're massacring them in the skirmish, yeah. Alright. Our points are doing really well, our allies are doing good in their war. Uh, did someone else just get called into the war? Great. Who are you? You just got called in. You have 800 troops. Okay, I just need to siege this guy's land more. Get him to give up. Because he just called an ally into the war, but he's at 99 positive in my favor. She finished her education. She's an intricate web weaver. The second best for intrigue. That's pretty good. Found another apostate. It's another fucking chaplain. Really? All right, isn't this <laughs> the same? Yeah, every chaplain this guy hires ends up being um, a warlock. Burn him. The cooks provide, uh, prepare to find meal. Okay, so if I eat, then for five years I will be, I'll have a little bit of extra health and the health is important. I also might become gluttonous. Stewardship down, that's our income down and possibly our demizen. I'd rather a chance of becoming temperate. Better stewardship. <sighs> we didn't become temperate. Damn, you get a notification up here. If you do, sorry, stifling a cough. Uh, successful, oh, the defender successfully raided the council of the besiegers, which is us, so we just lost some troops. It's a random event that can happen. Okay, there we go. This war is over. 288, nice. The war is over. Put down the troops. Let a month roll by. Boom. This is our income. We're back up to 93 ducats a year. Good. The war is over. All right. We still have this war to help with, though, don't we? Yeah, we only have 2% contribution to that war. You know, it's going to cost more money, but we're going to we're going to march over there anyway. But I don't want to be leading this army. Well, we'll take me out of that army soon, because I don't want to be leading it. I don't want to risk dying for another guy's war. Our kinsmen became Midas Touch. That's the best education in money. Nice. Might make a good steward, actually. Hmm. Not any better than my current one. Damn. Where I can get learning, but there's a chance of becoming a drunkard. Doesn't it hurt health? It should, uh, but Storish would get hurt. No thanks. Another chance of becoming temperate. Damn. Okay. I don't want to lead this one. Throw in our shitty goons. There you go. Oh, random uh, Jewish courtier who's really good at intrigue. Holy shit. I think I want this guy. Yeah. There you go. Okay, I just want to meet up with... <laughs> no. <laughs> I want to do that. Meet up with my allied army. Oh, another random Jewish guy. Okay. He's also really good at intrigue, but not as good. Oh, shit. Uh, no, I want to stick with you guys. Okay, so I can learn, um... Oh, I can lecture one of my, my marshal. I can either teach him organizer, which is movement speed and retreat speed, or flat terrain expert. Am I or an organizer? I wasn't even aware I was. Um, flat terrain expert. It actually helps in the fights. Oh, there we go. He was happy about it. Uh, he can go back to organizing the army, by the way. I don't care if my levy size is a bit smaller. Are oh, we going back up here? All right, I'm just going to stick with you. I bet we're just running back and forth. Go into hiding. Why is there a plot against me? Uh, there's a faction. This guy wants our uncle to become the... Uh... Oh, he just... He wants... This guy wants him to get... A county. Weird. He's not even in the plot of the people trying to get him to take it. Okay, known plot. 
My sister is trying to kill me. Who's a backer? My rival. I have a rival? I don't remember you. Wait, I'm war focus. Doesn't that mean I can, uh... Well, first of all, I can... I could tell him to stop backing it, which would be nice. If you're war focus, or if, I, if I'm if i on war focus, can't I challenge this guy to a duel? Why can't I? Wait, is he excommunicated? No. Uh... Oh, I'm the challenger and I'm Zealotus. Okay. God damn. Oh, I'm not Zealotus. I don't understand then. I'm just going to, uh. I'm just gonna go back to intrigue. Maybe I'll just tell this guy to stop. Oh. That's what it is. We're busy in a war. Fuck. I'm stupid. Uh, stop backing the plot, please. Thank you. Because I know you're trying to murder me. Okay, that got the chance to lower. Again, the murder plots will only start actually happening if it gets to 100% or higher, so we just lowered it. Which is good. We can't tell her to stop, because she'll just say no. I can't imprison her. She's not in my court. Where does she live? In France. Uh, all right. God, this war is a real waste of time. Where is he going? He's probably dealing with raiders up there. Okay, well, I'll keep sieging this place. Let's get this place. It seems to be of higher value. Offer to buy a new one. He'll get fussy. There we go. Yep. Some kinsmen that I don't care about. Right. Uh, we can spend some money again. Let's do that. Making good money off a lot of these places. Uh, this place is still pretty messed up. Yeah, it's still trying to recover from its raiding. Not that it was valuable in the first place. But we'll try and fix it. There we go. Castle Town's building in places that didn't have Castle Towns. Hey! Oh, excommunicated patriarch again. I just... I don't care about this excommunicated patriarch. I want to befriend the actual guy here. He's right there. Just making sure. God. So lame. Lame like the low talent of my counselor. Can I, or chancellor rather. Uh, can I get a better marshal? Oh, shit, you're good. Carl, Prince of Francia, you'll join? Prince Carl, son of the devil. Wait, you'll fucking join my country? Oh, he's got tons of strong claims. Yeah, this is Charlemagne's son. Yes, come to my court. You're incredibly talented. You can come to my court too. Holy shit. I could press that guy's claim, but he wouldn't be part of my, uh, I mean, he wouldn't join my country. Then it'd be a hell of a fight. Okay, there we go. You're the one organizing my army now. We're gonna get commander upgrades left and right with you. Look at that. That's awesome. And, uh, wouldn't mind a better steward if I could get one, which I can't. I'm pretty happy with everything else, though. I'm not really happy with my chancellor, but I can't. <coughs> it's dangerous to replace him because he's a powerful vassal. So he'd hate my guts and he'd probably join the murder plot against me. You are a scholarly theologian. That's pretty good. Who lacks a focus? One of my kinsmen. Another one of the kids of the... No, you're the bastard. Um, I don't know. Go study religion so you can feel shameful about how you're a bastard. Grey Eminence. Nice. It's a friend of mine. Okay. I... Okay. I don't know why I care, but uh, he's a really good diplomat now. And another one of my kinsmen... Uh, military education. Become a commander for me. Okay, you're you're marching in here, so I'm gonna march away. Oh, you're marching over here? Okay, where are we going? 
All right. Uh, they unseaged a place. That's fine. Uh, Midas touched. A Corteir. Weird. I don't know why he told me. Plays hard and talks straight. That's fine. Yeah. Becomes honest. Loses rowdy, though. Chance of becoming brave is better. Ooh. We're fighting over here? Okay, I'm joining in. Even if it's a river crossing. There we go. That's a big victory. That got us some score. See, we're 10% now, so they're not going to go thinking we're lazy. There's a chance if you don't participate in the war that uh, they'll break the alliance by saying, like, you may as well be an alliance breaker. Where are we going? You're going up back up there? Okay, I'm just going to keep sieging this place while you're gone. Um, Become stubborn? No, that's not good. Yeah, teach you to become proud. That's a better train. Oh, he's coming back up. I don't think I could take him on my own. Uh, yeah, I'll back off. I don't like that we got a revolt right next to Paris. I am going on a run to try and uh, improve my efforts to become a warrior. Nice. Castle Town done. Good. When can we change this? Uh, what year? 92. Okay. Because we're 19 now. I'd like to change it to something where I get health out of it. Still six more years, though, until my wife is of age to have kids. Uh, gains wrath. I have an anger issue. Gives me martial skill. What am I at? 20? Yeah, I'm at 20 with a state of 43. State marshal is very high. Ooh. I can crew a pretty big army for a country my size, considering I have, like, almost no military buildings. I have, like, a couple stables. I need to start building barracks soon for that heavy infantry. Because right now, I'm decent at the skirmish, but as soon as it gets to the close melee, that's when the Umyad usually beat me, because they outnumber me in heavy infantry. We're gonna have to turn that around. I feel like I've participated in this war enough, honestly. <laughs> Let's just get back to our country and start making money again. All right, build a barracks in the capital castle. Uh, some Corteir likes me? Uh, not my type. I don't want to get busted as an adulterer. Okay, good, that war ended, perfect. Yay, they white pieced out and they're immediately calling us into another war. Who are we at war with? Uh, middle Frank, a uh, small section of middle Frank, yeah. You know what? This will be fast. I'll join in. And we don't even have a middle commander now. Uh, one of my courtiers changed their culture. Okay, I don't care. Castletown built, nice. Get the capital of their tiny little duchy. Yeah, we're sieging it. Uh, perfect. No, you're just, just befriending this guy again. I mean, he really likes me, but I was kind of hoping this guy secluded within his court, and that's probably why it's not happening. I just, uh, it's painful. You know what? Fuck that guy. I've got a good alliance already. You get back to sowing dissent with the Umyad. I want them dealt with. Oh, uh, Betrothed can marry. Uh, yeah, sure. You are... Nothing special, got it. Barracks finished, nice, that'll increase the amount of heavy troops we have in our capital county. Excellent, Mastermind Theologian, that's as good as a uh, religious education as you can get. Oh, great. This Corteir got Misguided Warrior, which is the lowest education in military. Does it give health, though, which is decent. I think every military education gives you a little bit of health. All right, well, who are you? Armode! Um, Armode, right, you're betrothed to the Byzantine Emperor. Or the, em the Emperor's uh, son. Intrigue, military. The military's not going to do you any good. You've got a negative and a positive for intrigue. We'll just put you on intrigue, because that might actually be useful. Whereas the military, 
you're likely not going to end up using it. There we go. What's our contribution? Our contribution is 21%. All right. I'm done. I'm going home then. I did my work. Let's start getting our money back by not paying for these levy upkeeps. Oh yeah, we're gaining a little bit of martial out of studying military strategies. That's good. So we're at 21 martial then. God, our martial's crazy. Look at this. We're not even training troops. Um, and we have a maximum of 2,600 levies from personal damison. That's really good. I'd love to just get another upgrade to the barracks going, get more pikemen. Heavy infantry and pikemen. I also wouldn't mind getting a uh, keep. Yeah, increase the levy size by a percent and garrison size for defense. Training grounds is great, but we need castle wall too for that. How's our tech going? I need improved keep level two. If our spy master gets us one grouping of uh, like one random drop of economic advance, that would be enough to have our capital county get um, city balls level two, which would allow us to get a lot more stuff, which is pretty awesome. City balls level two lets us get to level three of Castle Town. That's even more money out of our capital, which is, of course, our most profitable one, because it has all kinds of little bonuses. You can see uh, here, if we see the breakdown, where is it? This is prospering, which is 10%. We're collecting tax here, which is 37.5%. Uh, and there's a bonus somewhere for it being my capital. I don't remember where. Or is it crown focus? No, that's more likely to prosper and develop, right? Yeah. Whatever. All right, let's run the clock a little bit. You're a detached priest, which is the lowest education of religion. That's, uh, yeah. Has no talent beyond basic literacy. Ooh, righteous imprisonment on you. Who are you? You have a small claim. You have no titles. You're one of my courtiers that I'm not using in any way. Are you trying to kill? You're trying to kill one of my kinsmen. You have no money, so if I imprison you and banish you, I wouldn't get anything out of it. You just, just shut up and stop trying to murder my kinsmen. <laughs> it's, oh, I see you've joined back in again. Stop backing the plot. <laughs> Fucking idiot. There. I got him out of the plot to kill me again. Give her money, but that's setting a bad precedent. You know, I'll give you money to stop trying to kill me. Everyone would just claim to be trying to kill me. Is that guy trying to unsiege his place? He totally fucking is. Hey, um... Whatever, whatever Carling is in charge right now? Yeah, you? How about you deal with that shit? Jesus, it's not that hard. God, what even are all these wars? Uh, I didn't even know we're fighting over there. Whatever. I contributed. Uh, you are random ass kinsmen. I don't know. I think it's just because I own so much property. I'm constantly being informed of every little fucking thing. I kind of want to give away some of my demizen. I don't want. I don't. Uh, that's my least profitable. You. I could give you away. Yeah. Who can I give you to? Who do I trust? Oops. Okay. I don't think I can give her land. Yeah, I can't. She doesn't even live with me, does she? Yeah, no, she lives in- Oh, she's the one trying to kill me, that's right. I don't want to give her land. Hmm. Armand's not old enough and she's living in the Byzantine Empire. Don't have any other siblings. Could always just give this guy more land, my uncle. I mean, I'm inheriting, or he's inheriting my stuff if I die right now anyway. Holds her betrothed 12, four more years to go. 
Hey, can I change my laws yet? I can. Um, I... Oh, my legalism skill isn't high enough for more centralization. That's a shame. Because my fast limit, I'm nowhere near the limit on. Dem is in size, I want up. Could change the, the tax rates. I wouldn't mind having nobles give me more levy. But honestly, I have so few nobles that right now it really doesn't matter. I do want the cities to give me more money, though. So, there we go. Our cities are now paying us more in tax, but less in levies. Which is funny, because they generate very little levies anyway, and mostly generate money. So, our city tax income will go up. There we go. Although, a lot of my mayors aren't paying me much, because their opinion of me is low, so they're siphoning money. Um, they'd like me more if I didn't have too big of a demison. Who's your heir? Uh, you've got kids. I kind of want to... Uh, I wish I could give it to someone who didn't have an heir, so he's going to come back to me anyway. The heir is my rival for that. I hate that guy. Can I just murder him? No, people don't dislike him. You're a prince. I'm not voting for you, though. Fuck that guy. Um... Should I just run the clock more? No, get more troops. Militia training ground. Light infantry and archers. Not many archers, but as I upgrade it more in the future, it'll be more archers. Okay, Viking Age has started, which means the Nordic um, cultures can start sea raiding now. So I gotta take care of my coast. Orthodox faith triumphs. Uh, okay, yeah, the Inoclast faith is no longer the majority. One of my commanders is significantly improved. He got the aggressive leader trait, which is mostly good. He's also getting some martial skill. Nice. See, that's why organizing the army is good. You start getting those bonuses where your commanders become better and better. And then whenever your marshal dies, hopefully one of your commanders will have gotten enough martial skill to make a good replacement marshal. Uh, good. You've sown descent between the, the, the Sultan of the Umyad and some of his subjects. Good. I want them to have revolts and stuff. I want them to all hate their sultan. Salty about their sultan. Uh, just, oh, I can seek treatment right now? I didn't even know. I guess I haven't done it in a while. Goat, oh, he did the goat fart treatment again. And it worked again, yay, staying healthy. Uh. Pepin the Hunchback, why are you named after the Carlings? Oh, you're a Carling. Okay. You just randomly showed up. Weird. Yeah, you're a Hunchback, that doesn't help. A paranoid Hunchback who's not particularly talented. Um, should I benefit if I study the languages of a foreign court? Excellent idea. Is He gains a favor with me, which I'm not thrilled about. Uh, and I gain one learning. I can either become shy or proud if I if I refuse. Shy is, hurts diplomacy. My diplomacy is already not great. Boom! Hey, I gained proud! Yay, I wanted proud! That actually ended up paying off. I'll get more prestige. My prestige is already pretty good. Over a thousand. Uh, you are now Frankish? That's fine, I don't care. Um, store to go special tithe. Yeah, 56 bucks. Nice. I like that. And brilliant strategist. Nice. Another one of our kinsmen. Brilliant strategist. You're also a trickster. I want to make you a commander. I've appointed you as one of my commanders. I'm sure he's happy about that. Ooh, a small spear throwing competition could, in could be entertaining. And it's also a great way to enliven your battle technique. Okay. Uh, maybe you should arrange a contest. Yes, everybody will be amazed by my throwing arm, so everyone will like me more because uh, I hold a contest. Oh god. Everybody attending the spear throwing competition seems to be having a great time. They're partaking in the contest, conversing, having a laugh together. Perhaps the merriment was a bit too much, as the spear carelessly hurled into the field as someone was still out there, measuring the distance of the previous throw. Oh. A Corter uh, has been severely injured and mangled. Ooh, 
At least I had no plans to use you in any way. Sorry. It wasn't me. A dozen are thrown. Are you, you're the mangled one? Yeah. Known through farther than the mangled guy. Oh, the mangled guy won. Hey, he gained some prestige and is mangled for life. Your ability to take down any man in a brawl is widely renowned. Pick a fight is good to be recognized. Wait, this guy? Did I just get prestige for taking the mangled man down in a fight a day after his injury? That's fucking hilarious. I gained 100 prestige for that. Oh my god, I love this game. I love this game so much. Uh, alliances formed between my uncle and my cousin. Whatever. Only times men uh, become better friends. Of course, yeah. Yeah, become friends with whoever you want. A great time together. Cousin. Hey, me and my cousin got along better. Okay, that's almost done. Maybe upgrade the stables. More light cavalry will be good for the opening skirmish of a fight. Uh, archers are good for that as well. Um, barracks, though. They're good. You know, we'll wait for this to finish on our main castle and then upgrade it again. Good, he sowed more descent. Military training, or militia training ground rather. Done. Uh, another white piece, good. Upgrade the barracks. Oh, more heavy troops. What's our max? Look at that. We're almost at 3,000 troops levy max. We're still young, although we have cancer, so we're probably not gonna live super long. We're about half of what our main opponent is, while having what, 15% as much land as he does? This is what we get for developing our land really well. So we're gonna just develop the shit out of our land and we'll be overpowering that guy before you know. So like I was saying, there's gonna be like 50 to 80 years of just developing our land a lot and fighting defensive wars, then we're gonna start ravaging them. I show you a master of strategy. Here we go, adeptive strategy, plus one marshal and stewardship. We are at a marshal of 21. Nice. And I still really wouldn't mind. I think now is as good a time as any to switch to like hunting or family or something. Okay, you're gonna be adult in two years. I'll stick with war for two more years. The second she's 16, we switch to family, try and have some kids real fast, and then maybe do hunting for the rest of her life. So we keep the health. Hunting gives you a lot of health benefits, but we also have a bit of marshal from it to keep our army big and trained. Big, uh, better friends with another guy, sure. Oh, with this guy again, okay, yeah. Yeah, just, we get along really well with that guy, okay. All the wars are over, sweet. We can hold a grand tournament if we want, or we could duel that motherfucker, this guy. We could challenge him to a duel. Duels can be considered dangerous to your health, that is true. He's a terrible fighter, though. He's got no personal combat skill. I have a personal combat skill of, where does it, it usually says under this, doesn't it? Or does it equal out to zero because of our severe illness? You know what, yeah, I think it equals out to zero. Okay, I won't challenge him. Let's not take undue risks. You are backing the plot again, you fucker. How many times do I need to demand you stop? Raiders have arrived in the capital. That's fine. Just raise on him. There we go. Boom. Yeah, have you stay home for now. There we go. Warded off raiders before they did any serious damage. Oh, we lost- oh shit, our, our really, really, really good marshal must have just died. That already left. Man. Ah, uh, we had such a good marshal for a few years. Okay, uh, okay, yeah, you're still really good, though. And he's a genius, nice. We'll bring him in. Finish your education, intrigue, your flamboyant schemer, which is okay. And you're honest. I'd rather you become brave. All right, Marshal, here we go, and you'll just keep organizing the army. Betrothed can marry your sister and the prince. Yeah, do it. There we go. All right, and we're about to finish this barracks. Yep. There we go. Barracks been built. Another 
group of raiders. Yeah, just take care of it. And, uh, wow, we can have a lot of troops there. Look at that, mostly heavy infantry, good. We need those shock troops to move in. Could get our keep. God, I wish we could have a training ground already. That's really good, because it gives you retinue size. And I can't wait until I can get a retinue. Morale of armies. We need level 2 castle walls, though. We have a spymaster stunning Constantinople. How the fuck have we not... Ah... <sighs> Sometimes you get tech so fast, and sometimes you get it so slow. Um, yeah, go deal with that. And keep piling on the barracks in the capital county. Uh, he ran? Okay, that's fine. All right, now's a good time to end the episode. Sweet. On the next episode, we're going to start really building up our max military. Look at that. We're almost at 3,000 maximum. Until next time, have a nice day.